Welcome back, everybody, to another episode of Evan Better Presents Alpha 13 Let's Play. So, we dismantled, uh, while you guys were away, I dismantled the morgue, the super morgue, and better than that, put the dead jackass who falls and runs in zombie mode, put him into the locked off morgue. We won't have to deal with him anymore. Um, we've reestablished this as our morgue down here. And the super morgue has now become what it was originally intended to be, the security office. Security office's job, of course, is to have... This is where the excess guards go when they're not hanging around places. They all stand in the security office. And CCTV monitors can be placed in the security office. That allows us to put up CCTV cameras in some of these darker areas, like up here, in the visitation area, in this hallway. We can put one in each one of these workshops. Um, you know, just places where guards aren't patrolling as, as frequently. So here and over, he over here, over here. Uh, also, we finished the perimeter fence around the new cell block. Expensive. I put the lights up like I like. Okay. So they won't be getting through that. Hopefully. Don't really know for sure. It's a hell of a distance. I mean, they've really got to make an effort to try and escape. Uh, also, we are going to be converting this canteen and the kitchen into cell block. And we're going to move the canteen and the kitchen over here. So first things first, let's plan out where shit's going to go. So, I can buy another 9,000 square feet for $4,500, which we were going to do. All right, there we go. Because we ne we may need um, we may want more cell blocks. There's no reason to to, to shelve our our prison just yet. Not just. Yet. Let's just be realistic with the continuation of that. We won't necessarily build it out that far yet. All right, so the canteen will probably have to go. I, I mean, it's got to be big. It's got to be very, very big. Um, what's the current dimensions of it? 34 by... looks like 20. 34 by 20 currently. We're going to want to go a little bit bigger than that. I want to have at least a row of five. So right right now, what do we got in here? We got uh, 3, 6, 9, 3, 6, 9, 18, 19, 20, 21. So there's 21 in here right now. 21 tables. I want to add at least, at least another row. Same spacing. Another row on each side. Or maybe two rows high. So. Let's see. With the proper spacing. That would be. And then one, two, three. Space. This has got to be at least 22 high. Alright, at least 22 high. And I'm thinking perhaps what we do is we we make the canteen into this into this area over here. Build it right in. Oops. Let's just place it there. Ah, oh, shiza. Assholes are doing it again. Get him. Yeah, we finally have enough guards that uh, we can actually take care of these situations when they happen. Makes me happy. Anyway, back to what we were doing. So, for the proper canteen height, we need to do it... And then the next table will be 1, 2, 3, with a space, 24, at least 24 high, right? Make it 25 just to be on the clean side of things. So we know that it has to be at least 25 high. So 
So what's this hallway? So it's five, so I need ten. Ten, that should be twenty-five. Twenty-two. I don't understand. I'm measuring this wrong somehow. So that's eleven. And that's 11. Okay, there we go. Now we got it right. So it needs... Uh, again? Damn it. Go and support your fucking fellow cops. Shit's getting fucking real in here right now. I don't even know why. Seems like there's a lot of guys getting angry. What happened to Dan Laver? Is he dead? I hope he's dead. Let's go find out. He, he gained consciousness, just so, in case you guys were wondering. He did actually gain consciousness. I saw it. There he is. How you doing, Dan? Probably not doing so well, huh? What's the matter? Not happy? Well, you're not leaving that cell, so get used to it, asshole. Alright, back to our canteen. The current dimensions of this canteen are fine, in my opinion. But I'd like to extend it one more over, like I said. So, space. One, two, three. One, two. Thirty-seven. Make it Thirty-eight for good measure. What is he doing in there? How did he get in there? How did he get in there? I don't get this. What is going on? There's no way in and out of that wall. So how the hell are they doing that? Can you stick his ass in a cell, please? Ay, 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 ay. You know, there's supposed to be a guard on patrol in here, and this guy's not doing a very good job. What is your fucking problem? Get your ass back in the security office! Thirty-eight. Okay, let's try and get this planning done. Okay, that's the width of the canteen, but we have to also include the kitchen. I like the way our kitchen is right now, so I want to do the same same size kitchen. Sixteen by seventeen. What now? Really losing my patience with these assholes. Alright, so 16 by 17 has to be the canteen area, or the kitchen area. Was it 16 across? Damn it, now I don't. It's 
16 across by 17. Oh, man. Now, the only problem is that's really far from the deliveries area. Probably gonna have to add workers to the kitchen. Somebody put him in a cell, please. Escort him to a cell before he causes trouble. Losing my patience, losing my patience. These guys are fucking around. So it'd be, be about this big. Alright, so they would come into the canteen just like that. All prisoners come down this hallway into the canteen. Now I have to take into account that there's this hallway is just going to open up into this, so I want to have some spacing here, so I might have to push the canteen out a little bit further than that. So I want to have at least three, so they can disperse. So the first table would be right here, kind of thing. Are they three or four? I cannot remember. Four. What now? Really? Fucked up the holding cell? What is wrong with these guys lately? Why was he even in a holding cell? They fucked up the common room again? Ugh. I'm losing my frickin' patience. Anyway, back to work. So the first table will be right there. Wait, 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 wait. Kitchen is here. The doorway to the entrance would be there. Serving tables are five. Five. I always forget the serving tables. Where are they going to go? Right? I always forget that, so. One serving table. This seems too long here, so that's 11. No, it's the same height. Interesting problem. Hmm. Interesting, interesting, interesting. I want to make sure I have room for the serving tables. If I extend the wall by one, that works. I have to extend it by two, actually. One. There we go. So then that gives them to come out. On this side, same idea. There we go. Kit, the cooks come out, they do their serving table stuff here. And in fact, I want to try and turn... Oh, I want to give them a hallway to access the kitchen off of this main hallway. I wonder if there's a way I can do that.
Yeah, well that didn't... I wanted to have it two from this wall anyways, and now I'm not two from that wall, so I gotta do that. I gotta fix that anyway. Alright, so... Staff only door. Be there. Where, why are, where are you trying to go? You're not going out there. Once again, you guys have seemed to forgotten things. So staff only hallway here. I want it. I want two gap from this fence, regardless. So two gap. There's the first wall. Staff only hallway is too wide. So there's the staff only hallway that goes up for the perimeter of the kitchen. Then the kitchen has to be 16 wide from that point. There to here. Okay. Canteen comes out another few meters as a result. Four meters more. What is being found? There's a lot of dings for contraband. Holy shit. We have to do a search. Let's just do a quick look at... Uh... Holy crap. There's a lot of supply of weapons and narcotics in our prison right now. We're going to have to deal with that. Let's just finish this planning. Doorway, one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five. Got the doorway there. Prisoners come in. There's a three gap from that point. One, two, three. First table goes right there. Okay. Five, five. Okay, we're going to have to extend this down one. Alright, that's going to look good, I think. It is a bit of a far trip for those poor, gar those poor kitchen staff, unfortunately. But, uh, it is what we have to do. How many wide, or how many tables I got in here right now? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven across. Ugh, it's getting laggy. Dan Laver, how you doing, buddy? How you making out? Not having a good time? No? Well, you're standing there for another day or so. Until you learn to stop destroying everything in my entire prison. <clears throat> what we will do is we'll continue this Staff only hallway out to uh, 
at least out to here. Ugh. That should at least give them a little bit more distance to travel. <clears throat> then that'll be closed off. This will be opened up to prisons, to the prisoners. I'll turn this into more prison cells. Um, they'll still have to go through this checkpoint here, I think. I think that'll be the best way to do it. We'll extend the shower down, because if we're making it bigger, it's going to it's gonna need more shower space, so we'll extend the shower down. Just say, we'll just say something like that. We'll figure the rest out soon enough. Okay. So I, that last one was seven across, right? So six... Seven, eight. There we go. And we'll give it the same rules on this side, so I want to have a three gap. Yeah, I hate, I hate things that aren't symmetrical. We'll just do this. Yeah that up somehow. There's a three gap here. One, two, three. One, two, three. There we go. So that's how the cantina will look. One, two, three. Oh, now there's a three gap at the bottom. Uh, can't win. All right, scrap that. So the canteen will be this big. I will give it a four gap on this side too, just in case there's more cells down this way. Plan for the future. Okay. So that, friends, is how big this canteen is going to be in the future. What to do next? All right. Sleep time now, so maybe we can actually get started on some of that work. Fire off these assholes. After they dump a few things for me. Hmm. That'll do. That'll do, donkey. That'll do. All right, now how are we going to do this? Because basically, I need to build a new canteen before I build. Pretty nice, I think. Alright, so let's get the foundation laid. In the next episode, everything will be beautiful.
It's a pretty freaking big place, I gotta say. I might end up... Might end up having to make more changes going forward. I don't know yet. Well, we'll see. We'll see how things work. Like I said, this is considerably larger than I was expecting originally, so... We'll have to see what happens. Maybe we'll turn part of this into workshop space, the kitchen. You know, maybe if we add another workshop. No, because the workshop would have to be past my staff hallway. No, I don't want to do that. I want the staff hallway there. It's important. But we will have to take into account that this is now considerably further away. It's probably going to take them 45 minutes to walk there from these two cell blocks. I wonder if they can even reach that. There's a way to walk there. Yeah, there is. Along the top. They're doing fine. They'll figure it out. Alright. <clears throat> Just going to call it there. And I will see you guys all in the next episode. And remember, make sure every day is Evan Better Day.